Why do we celebrate the anniversary of an assassination? Fifteen years ago, in the middle of a plague that nearly destroyed Dunwall, a paid killer assaulted the palace where I was born and stabbed my mother in the heart. In the aftermath, the men who sent the assassin tried to use me as a pawn in a game of power. They would have succeeded, but my father, Corvo Atano, hunted them down and cut their conspiracy to pieces. All these years later, am I the ruler my mother wanted me to be? Now, we face a new crisis. A monster the papers are calling the Crown Killer has been picking off my enemies and dressing it up like my father and I are responsible. I don't know whether to get on a ship and sail to the opposite side of the world, or to have everyone around me executed. Watch your step, Majesty. I'm not looking forward to all the ceremony today. Your signet ring. There, you're ready. Thank you, Alexei. Open the doors. All hail Her Imperial Majesty, Emily Caldwin. Loyal subjects. We're going through a difficult time, but today we honor my mother, the late Jessamine Caldwin. May her memory survive through the ages. Emily. You look tired, Father. Every year, I think the anniversary of Jessamine's death will be easier, but it never is. I wish Mother was still the Empress. I don't think I'm very good at this. You're still learning. Don't worry about the rabble-rousers, and we'll catch the Crown Killer, eventually. People are saying it's you, that these assassinations are a misguided effort to protect me. No, someone's trying to make us look guilty by targeting your enemies. I wish I could just run away from all this. Sometimes you do. You think I don't know about your nights out on the rooftops? Courage. The ceremony will be over soon. Royal protector and father. I should have passed a law against that combination of titles years ago. Before we begin the day's observances, we have an unexpected visitor, the Duke of Circonos. Ramsey says the Duke is bringing special gifts. That's intriguing. His Grace Luca Abel, Duke of Circonos! Mechanical soldiers? Amazing. What is this, Ramsey? I didn't authorize those things. Your Imperial Majesty and Royal Protector Corvo Atano, a native of our homeland, Sirconus offers condolences on this sorrowful day and gifts to remind you of our nation, the rising star on the southern horizon. We thank you, Your Grace. Save your thanks, for now I give you the greatest gift of all, family. I present the lost sister of Jessamine Caldwin, your rightful Empress. Delilah called me. Impossible. My mother had a sister. My dearest niece. Hello. It's not true. My father was Emperor Yuhorn Jacob Caldwin, and Jessamine was my younger sister. At the time of her death, I wasn't ready to make myself known to you, and I was forced to leave Dunwall. But now I'm home. If you really are my mother's sister, you're welcome to stay as long as you like. Little Sparrow, blackened by bad memories, I'm here to relieve you of your crown. My father's promise, whispered in secret so many years ago, is now fulfilled. Watch your tongue. Emily Caldwin is the daughter of Empress Jessamine Caldwin. Royal Protector, how naive to think you could get away with these murders. Living in my palace has protected you, but that's over. Hear me, all of you. 
Your rightful Empress has returned. All hail the Empress Delilah. First of her name. Arrest Emily Caldwin and her father for the Crown Killer murder. What? Lady Emily in her chambers, and I'll bring her to cold uh, prison until her trial. My father lost it all when I was a boy, so now I wear this uniform, and I send 20-year-olds out to patrol the Rose Gardens instead of drinking with the men from the shooting club. Captain Ramsey, I heard shouting. Lady Emily! What happened? That'll be all, Captain Mayhew. Protector's fancy weapon. What kind of sword folds in half? There's a legend in the Tower Guard about the Empress's last resort, a safe room inside your chambers holding enough gold to buy a good-sized island. They say that this ring is one of the only two keys to exist. What, what happened? Alexei. The throne room. Father! <laughs> 